Hi folks, welcome back to another episode of the Single Dad's Cookbook. Today we're going to be making chili, and this is another episode of Adventures in the Slow Cooker. So, and this is, um, I suppose you you could class it as a cook along, because um, I'm going to show you how to do it in real time. And this was again, uh, I suppose, an experiment to see. Can you just dump in beef mince? Does it need to be coloured? Do you need to brown it? Does it, do you, does it need to give it an extra dimension? Or can you just throw it all in? Leave it, come home at night, and it's ready. So the first thing I'm doing is I'm just thinly slicing um, the onions. And while I'm doing that, I want to say welcome to the channel, if this is your first time visiting. I ask all visitors to almost sign in um, by leaving uh, a comment down below on where you're watching this video. Um, and I'd really like to hear from the American contingent of the channel on your chilli recipes. Because um, every time I watch a bit of TV, you guys have got the greatest variety of chilli. Now, I am not a bean man, and no one in my family um, are are bean people, so there is no beans in this. You can add kidney beans, uh, or any kind of bean that you want, into this dish, um, as you see fit. So, I'm just finally chopping that. I would also like to say, I read all the comments, um, so thank you very much, um, and... I'm blessed to to read some of these comments that you have tried them and they're reminding you at home and all that kind of stuff. So if you are new to the channel, think about subscribing. Cost you nothing, but it means the world to me. So I'm just chopping up some garlic. Again, thinly slicing some garlic. You don't have to go that fast. Um, you can just take your time. And then on to the chilies. Now, a little disclaimer. I probably made this a bit too hot for, for, for our liking. Um, probably one of these chilies would have been enough. Or um, just the dry flake chilies would have been enough. So again, I'm just thin, thinly slicing the chilies. Because the logic was that they would break down through the, the, the cooking process. Which again is the 8 hours. That's the standard sort of time that I'm, I've got on the slow cooker cooking thing that um, I have. I've just got some 5% beef, so I'm just taking that out, and um, now I did read in the comments um, that if you mash it together, it doesn't make it look all stringy, so I've done that. After I've done that, I've went away and I've washed my hands, because um, you've got to make sure everything is sanitary. Um, this chilli, as I was doing it, currently the... This, the football World Cup's on, or the soccer World Cup, depending on where you, you want to watch, where you're watching this video. Um, so I thought that this would be great if you just set it up overnight, you've got people coming round, um, something everybody can just tuck into. So, into the min beef mince, I'm just adding some salt and some pepper. Then that goes into the cauldron. Really, that easy. And then into the cauldron, I'm going to add in the onions. And I'm, again, I'm doing this real time just to show you, like, the whole preparation time um, is is very, 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 very quick. So, again, just popping everything that was on the board in there. Now we're going to pop in some of the spices once I've got all the, the onions and the garlic in there. So into this, I'm now going to add in some smoked paprika. Probably a dessert spoon of paprika to give it a nice red, f and that's smoked paprika. I'm then going to add in probably, I added in again, maybe half a dessert spoon of ground cumin. Then I'm adding in some chilli flakes because I thought, why not? <laughs> then I'm going to add 
Then I'm adding in one tin of crushed tomatoes, and then I'm I'm adding in a third of the tin of water. And that is it. That's it done. Now, I know everybody's going to go in the comments saying, oh, you shouldn't mix it. But I wanted to mix it because I wanted it to give it an even cook all the way through. Couldn't find my wooden spoon, so I used my spatula. <laughs> so I'm just giving that a mix. So everything at this moment, completely raw, everything in, then we're going to pop it in the slow cooker for the eight hours. But that's it. Five minutes, job's done, everything's in, job's a good one. Eight hours set, I'm primed. And here we go. So let's have a little look. It's all done. And there you have it. It's all broken down. It's got a bit of liquid in it. It's really spicy. Um, so you, if you can just adjust the spice on your taking. It's all broken down nice. So this is a success that ground beef cooks down well in the slow cooker. Absolutely the success. So let's get this plated up. There you have it. Folks, I hope you're all looking after yourselves out there, okay, and each other. Um, as always, it is a pleasure doing these type of videos, and I'm, I'm glad you're along with me for the journey in the slow cooker. Um, and I, I genuinely mean it. From my family to yours, thanks for watching. Until the next time, Single Dad, signing off.